What's up guys and girls, welcome to another video. This video I wanted to make since Lauren Legends was released, I want to show you that Fenrir most likely is already in Asgard trap there. Fenrir, like the serpent, is supposed to be a child of Atreus, so is he even in this world? Before I answer, thank you to my YouTube channel members. Becoming a member, you get your name in my videos like you're seeing now, and it's easier to get in contact with me, depending on the tier you choose. Also, I'm working on some cool animations for God of War, so subscribe to know when it's finished. So, for this answer, we'll start with God of War 2018 book, as well as Lore and Legends. Both of these are canon official books. In the God of War novel, when Atreus and Kratos came across a massive mural of Skull and Hati, when Kratos saw this mural, he remembered where he was still in his Greek clothes being dragged by these three wolves. There was one wolf in the front and two others flanked his left and right. He then asked himself, why did these creatures bring him to this land and why was he meant to be here? So according to this book, Skull, Hati, and Fenrir must have dragged him to this world so he can arrive here. However, the lore doesn't stop there. Thanks to the other God of War book, Lore and Legends, it states 115 years ago is when these three wolves brought Kratos to this world. However, the book also states, when Kratos with these wolves arrived, the Norse world entered a vicious snow that lasted two years. So when Kratos, who I believe is the physical manifestation of Ragnarok, and Fenrir alongside Skolnahati, that's when this winter overcame the world, starting a mini Fimble winter. So let's get into why I believe Fenrir is already in Asgard. So, when the three wolves arrived in this world, using Kratos' body basically as a game of fetch, bringing him here, two years later, they were caught, and that's when winter ended. Here is a clip of Mimir talking about Skalnahati being captured and dragged to Asgard. We're born of the archwolf Hrothwitnir, a great nemesis of the Aesir gods. Odin captured them as pups and kept them in the kennels of Asgard to hold his foe at bay. But when the sun and moon grew mutinous and stood still, Odin put Skull and Hati to use. Mamir said Odin had Skull and Hati trapped in cages in Asgard before he sent them to chase the sun and moon. Mamir calling Fenrir a great nemesis of the Aesir gods definitely means that Fenrir and the Aesir fought in the past. Mamir also said that Odin captured the pups to keep Fenrir at bay. So perhaps Fenrir lost that fight because Odin managed to do something to the pups capturing them and then Fenrir pretty much gave up because of it. And again, the three wolves were together when they arrived. So if Skull and Hati were captured and taken to Asgard, it would mean Fenrir was as well. When Kratos saw the mural, he remarked that the mural showed Skull and Hati much bigger than when they were when they dragged him here, which wouldn't make sense since they had over 100 years time to grow. I'm sure if Fenrir and Odin fought again, since Fenrir is a lot bigger, the wolf can destroy the god just like the real mythology. Speaking of the real mythology, Brock and Sindri in the myth had made these unbreakable chains which are used to hold down Fenrir and again, the real myth. In God of War 2018, these chains have already been made a long time ago. Take a look at this clip. How are Brock and Sindri supposed to build with whatever they are? Don't count the dwarves out, lad. They're right pricks, but they're resourceful. They once made an unbreakable chain out of little more than a cat's footstep and bird spit. That doesn't even make sense. Well, that's the legend. If you wanted sense, you shouldn't be talking to a severed head. So yeah, with all of this, I believe Fenrir is already chained up in Asgard. What do you all think of this? If you want to know why I think Kratos is the physical manifestation of Ragnarok, check out the video on the top. If you want to know the true speed of Hermes in a crazy breakdown I did, click the video on the left and on the right side, I talk about why Asgard might be in the next game. I'ma be out of here, thank you all for listening. Deuces!